Hello YouTube, it's your boy, B3, with his best friend in the world, Big Boy Chungus. Hello. Uh, back with another Magic the Gathering... Pack, pack opening. opening. Yeah, <laughs> very good. You just space out. There's no happiness left in my life. Especially when you're beyond death. I wish. <laughs> anyway, but yeah, this is the newest set, Theros Beyond Death. Um, this is our first pack opening of it. Not the first ones we've gotten, but the first ones we've done a pack opening for. Yeah. Uh, just picked these up today, the local comic shop. And uh, before we start, I do want to announce our new podcast, Tabletop Recap, where we talk about all kinds of tabletop and trading card games. We tell stories, do reviews, uh, comparisons, all kinds of fun stuff on the podcast. It's me and Big Boy Chungus and uh, guests as well. And uh, we actually did a recent episode all about the set before this one, so whenever a new set comes out, we're going to do a whole episode about the set before. Mm -hmm. So uh, these are your cards, so how about you jump into them? we got five packs today. Okay. And that's whack, okay? I see. Oh boy. Oh yeah. I see. Uh, I'm I still you. working on the rhyming thing. Yeah, you're also still working on opening this pack because you're a troglodyte. Shut up. <laughs> I swear to God, it's only when I'm on this podcast that I have a hard time opening them. Uh, okay, well, this is weird. Okay. Oh, they got these reversed somehow. What? What? What are you the, the rare is on the front. What? Weird. Yeah, this is weird. They got them reversed. So we have Faraka's Libation, Nexus Wardens, Memory Drain. Oh, that's a weird looking card. Sun Main Pegasus. Oh, I think that's the, the van. trash bag that we put all the Dungeon Dragon <laughs> stuff in. The van, the vent is making it wiggle. We have uh, Warbriar Blessing. Witness of Tomorrows. Triumphant Surge. Satyr's Cunning. Thaumaturge is familiar. Sounds like Thermenturgy. Cling to Dust. Shimmering Chimera. That's cool art. Mm-hmm. Uh, Rise to Glory. Ooh! Elspeth Conqueror's Death. That's the one you pulled uh, from the bundle. Yeah, right? I actually was... I was needing another one of these. Now I have two that I need for my deck. Cool. Those are great cards. Yeah. And then we have a few more. We have Dreamstalker Manticore as a foil. Foil. And these awesome new forests that kind of look like solar clouds. Yeah, because I've never really uh, seen that big of a change in Magic Land before. But I haven't been playing very long. But Yeah, they're making all kinds of changes. I think it started with the uh, Throne Sail of Eldraine. Yeah. Sales must be down. <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm single-handedly supporting the whole company because I'm addicted and I can't open packs. Yeah, that too. Oh, here you go. That's how you do it. Yeah, they, they set these up differently. You're supposed to tear them down the middle now. Oh. And they, they put these... Okay, they, they don't normally do these like these. They're on the back now. All right, Inspire Awe, Nyxborn Marauder, uh, Underworld Charger, Skull Grove Dancer, Flummoxed Cyclops, uh, Nyxborn Seaguard, Sentinel's Eye, Nyxborn Colossus, Arena Trickster, Glory Bearers, Glimpse of Freedom, ooh, it's a labyrinth, Acolyte of Affliction, 
Ooh, legendary creature. Uh, Annex Hardened in the Forge. This is an uncommon legendary. I actually have a bunch of the alternative art for this guy, so it's actually nice that I have his original art. Ooh, another Saga as the Rare. This one oh, has four. Yeah. I haven't seen this one yet. What's it do? The first Iron Games. All right, so the first counter is, sorry, create a 1-1 one, one white human soldier creature token. Second phase is put three 1-1 one, one counters on target creature you control. Uh, if you control a creature with power four or greater, draw two cards. And then create a gold token, whatever that is. I'd have to actually have the token for that to find out. Yeah, I don't know what that is either. It's probably something good, though, if it's on a rare card. Yeah, if it's the final thing on there. Yeah, and then we have the tokens. So that's nice. I'm really happy for that. This is nice. My wife! Ow. Borat's still funny, right? Yeah. <laughs> I just yeah. don't know if it's... I, like, I love that answer. Yeah. <laughs> you really meant it, I could tell. Turd. Yeah, open it up. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. One, two, three. <laughs> like we do with Pokemon. Well, we're doing it differently this way. I'm just going to do it this way. All right, we have a Furious Rise, Heliod's Punishment, Thermaturge is Familiar, Nixon Brute, Trident Wave Rider, oh, cool. Sentinel's Eyes, Omen of the Forge, Ichthomorphosis. This is basically Frogify, but with a yeah. fish. Captivating Unicorn, Flicker of Fate, Plummet, Omen of the Dead, Elemental Token, Mountain Token, and then our Rise and other uncommon is Shatter the Sky. Each player who controls a creature with power 4 or greater draws a card, then destroy all creatures. It's pretty good. And wow. rise to glory. That'd be a good way to reset. Mm-hmm. <laughs> if you're really behind. Hey, Bruce. This is a whole Greek mythology set, right? Yeah. It's pretty easy to tell. Would you like some help? No, I got I'm it. dead serious. Would you like to sacrifice your, your pride for like half a second and just let me help you? I'd like to sacrifice you. Wow! <laughs> Absolutely that's murder! <laughs> Incredible. You're All a right. fiend. <laughs> Alright, we have Blood Aspirant, uh, Alcyad of Life's Bounty, Field of Ruin, Wrap in Flames, Nyxborn Courser, Thrill of Possibility, Daybreak Chimera, Starlit Mantle, Venomous Hierophant, That's cool art. Brawn Sword, Rage Scarred Berserker, um, Hissian Chiratid, Funeral Rites, and then our rare is Wavebreak Hippocamp. Whenever you cast your first spell during each opponent's turn, draw a card. It's meant to be played with instance. Nice. The hippocamps in Age of Mythology are used as scouts. Cool. <laughs> Thanks for at least putting effort into sounding like you care. <laughs> I, actually, I don't mean to sound like a jerk. I've just never played these things you talk about. <laughs> wow, that's cool. Whoa, tell me more. Psych, I don't care, Leaf. <laughs> I didn't say that. You've told me to leave plenty of times. Not genuinely. <laughs> I mean, yes, yeah, it's I mean, joke. I always meant it, but it's not like I'll enforce it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. All right, little Carterinos. All right, we have Heroes of the Revel. Agonizing Remorse, Aspect of Manticore, Thermaturge's Familiar, Deny the Divine, Indomitable Will, Omen of the Sea, Final Death, Rumbling Sentry, Neela's Forerunner, Soul Reaper of Mogus, Towering Wave Mystic, Token, Land, and Protean Thermaturge. 
Creature Human Wizard. Consolation. Whenever an enchantment enters the battlefield under your control, you may have Protean Thermoturge become a copy of another target creature, except it has this ability. Interesting. And then Nissan Horn Beetle. Oh, I like it being on a scorpion's tail. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Unless that's like a manticore tail or something. It might be. I mean, it is Greek mythology. They were all about creating homunculuses and stuff like that. Homunculi! Whatever. All right, that's it. That's all the packs. Yeah, get out of here. Unsubscribe. Just kidding. Please don't. <laughs> I got ahead of myself. I mean, it's your channel. But remember, we do have a tabletop and trading card podcast called Tabletop Recap. Link in the description below if you're interested in listening. So that's it. Thank you all once again for your support. We're going to go do something, and I'll see you all later.